everybody, I am in the process of changing over my pots for more of a winter look. I've got one done, and then I'm gonna try to duplicate that for this second one to, so I can show you the steps. I had these planted up for fall, but I like to keep my fall plants in until after Thanksgiving. But now that we're getting close to Christmas, I want more of a wintry look. So, I went ahead and I just cut everything back that I had in this pot down to soil level, and I just left the pyracantha alone because it still looks really pretty. And the reason why I leave the soil is because it acts as a really good anchor for everything I'm gonna be putting in the pots. And I brought home a lot of really pretty greens to use. I'll be using some noble fir, some really pretty cedar. This stuff drapes really well. Princess pine, some really great variegated holly that's got some pretty red berries. And then I went into our backyard and cut a bunch of red twig dogwoods. These make an excellent centerpiece in the pot. And then I will work on uh, adding in some pine cones in the end. So now I'm just gonna work on filling them up and we'll speed that part up for you. So as you can see, it's really easy to do. All I did was take my clippings and stick them down in the soil. When you get them looking the way you want, just water them in really well. We live in Eastern Oregon, so it's really cold here right now. So after I water them in, that, will, that water will freeze and it'll freeze everything right into place. So it works out really perfect. It really doesn't take much to make your pots look absolutely gorgeous for the holidays. Just run out into your yard and see if you've got any evergreens, trees or shrubs that need a little bit of a prune job. You can use those clippings in a project like this or save the trimmings off the bottom of your Christmas tree and use those, or you can check with your local nursery. A lot of times they'll carry a supply of fresh greens around the holiday times. Well, I hope you like this project. If you're watching this video on Facebook, make sure to cruise on over to our channel on YouTube. And if you're watching this on YouTube, make sure to subscribe down below. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.